Have you ever stopped in the middle of a supermarket, held a banana in your hand, and wondered what has this simple fruit really been through before reaching you? It's hard to believe, but every year the world harvests over 136 million tons of bananas, enough to cover thousands of soccer fields. In the Philippines alone, nearly 9 million tons are exported annually, making bananas one of the most consumed fruits on the planet. And here's a surprising fact, bananas don't grow on trees, as most people assume. They sprout from giant herbaceous plants that can tower up to 7 meters high, thriving in hot, humid, tropical climates. Each heavy bunch can weigh up to 50 kilograms, and must be carefully nurtured for months. Farmers shield the developing bananas with blue plastic bags to protect them from pests, scorching sun, and sudden rainstorms. But that's only the beginning. Did you know these bananas must survive long journeys across oceans in chilled containers to stop them from ripening too early? They travel thousands of miles before they ever touch a grocery store shelf or a kitchen countertop. So the next time you peel a banana, take a moment to appreciate this incredible process. In today's video, We'll follow the banana's full journey, from lush tropical farms and dedicated farmers, to packing lines, shipping ports, and finally, to your table. Get ready to discover the amazing story behind one of the world's most familiar fruits. Unlike most fruits, bananas don't grow from seeds. They begin their life as tiny offshoots called pups sprouting up around the base of a healthy mother plant. These small green shoots wait for the perfect conditions before they grow into strong leafy banana plants. Throughout tropical regions from the lush hillsides of the Philippines to fertile plantations in Ecuador, farmers carefully select these pups and transplant them into rich, well-draining soil that will nourish them as they grow. Banana plants thrive only in warm, humid climates. Year-round sunshine and regular rainfall help them stretch toward the sky, sometimes reaching 7 meters in height. Farmers enrich the soil with organic fertilizers and water them meticulously, especially during dry spells to ensure every plant stays strong and green. But cultivating bananas is never a hands-off task. Far from it. Farmers constantly walk their fields to inspect every stalk, removing weeds and pruning older leaves so each plant can focus its energy on producing a single perfect bunch of bananas. When tiny green bananas appear, they grow in large clusters that gradually swell into familiar curved shapes. Farmers often protect these delicate bunches with blue plastic bags, an effective shield against pests, birds, scorching sun, and heavy tropical rains that could bruise the fragile fruit. This simple step is crucial for ensuring bananas grow smooth, spotless, and evenly sized, qualities that buyers around the world demand. And the work doesn't end there. Farmers monitor the ripening process closely, knowing exactly when to cut the bunch, too early, and the fruit won't fully develop its flavor, too late, and it will bruise or ripen too fast. Every decision requires experience, patience, and a deep respect for the land. By the time harvest day arrives, typically 9 to 12 months after planting, the farmers have invested countless hours of labor into each bunch. This careful, hands-on process is what lays the foundation for every sweet banana that reaches your table. Behind every banana lies a story of skill, dedication, and an unbreakable connection between the farmers and their tropical land. When the bananas are finally plump and green, it's time for one of the most demanding and skillful stages of the journey, the harvest. Each bunch of bananas can weigh anywhere between 30 to 50 kilograms, 
as much as a grown person, and must be handled with extreme care to prevent bruising. Farmers rarely work alone during this process. Typically, one worker wields a sharp curved knife or machete to cut the thick stalk, while another stands by, ready to catch the heavy bunch on his shoulder. Timing is critical. Farmers look for that perfect shade of green and the right fullness of the fingers before deciding to cut. Once cut, the bananas must move quickly. Farmers can't simply drop them into crates. They would bruise and lose their value. Instead, they often hang the bunches on an overhead cable or pulley system that glides across the plantation, keeping the fruit suspended and safe as it's carried out of the field. This clever system, sometimes as simple as a few ropes and hooks, greatly reduces damage and backbreaking labor. And this isn't an easy job. Working under the tropical sun, balancing a 50-kilogram bunch on one's shoulders, all while navigating uneven ground, is an exhausting daily routine. Farmers must stay alert, communicate clearly, and use practiced hands to make sure nothing falls. Every successful harvest is the result of teamwork, endurance, and generations of knowledge passed down. By the end of the day, hundreds of these green bunches have been gathered. Even after they leave the field, the careful handling continues. For these bananas must stay pristine all the way to the packing house and eventually across oceans. Once the bananas leave the fields, they begin a new, carefully managed stage of their journey. The freshly harvested bunches arrive at the packing facility, where the first step is to gently separate them into smaller hands and wash them thoroughly in large tanks of cool, clean water. This bath is vital. It removes dust, sticky sap, and any tiny insects that may have clung to the skin. It also quickly lowers the banana's temperature, helping slow the ripening process. Next comes the sorting and grading. Workers with a practiced eye check each bunch for size, color, shape, and even small blemishes. Only the best bananas, those with uniform curves and a smooth green skin, are approved for export. Imperfect fruits, though still tasty, may be set aside for local sale or for processing into chips, puree, or baked goods. The packing line is like a smooth, steady rhythm. Workers nestle the bananas inside boxes lined with protective padding, making sure the fruit will not rub or bruise during the long trip ahead. Labels are applied indicating the farm, lot number, and destination, allowing every shipment to be tracked as it journeys across the ocean. In these quiet, chilly warehouses, the bananas wait like sleeping giants, paused at the perfect stage of green. It is here that the skill of the workers, the precision of the process, and the care taken at every stage make the difference between a perfect banana and one that never reaches its full potential. Each vessel carrying thousands of boxes of bananas bound for countries like Japan, South Korea, China, Europe, and the United States. Upon arrival at international ports, inspectors quickly check the bananas for quality and proper handling before allowing them to pass customs. Then the containers are loaded onto refrigerated trucks and trains, racing toward regional distribution centers. Every link in this long chain, from the ocean to the highway, is carefully managed so the bananas remain at their best. Finally, they appear in grocery stores, farmers markets, and fruit stalls often thousands of miles away from where they were grown. This remarkable journey, powered by ocean currents, careful logistics, and the skill of countless workers, allows millions of people around the world to enjoy a fresh, delicious banana every day. Not all bananas end up on store shelves. 
many are sent straight into factories to be transformed into a surprising variety of products that people around the world enjoy every day. In one part of the factory, ripe bananas are peeled, sliced into even, wafer-thin pieces, and sent along a conveyor into large fryers. Here, they turn into crispy, golden banana chips that crackle with flavor, a favorite snack for both kids and adults. Meanwhile, other bananas are mashed into smooth pulp and dried into a fine, nutrient-rich banana flour. This flour is packed with natural sweetness and can be blended into baked goods like bread, muffins and cookies, or stirred into smoothies and breakfast bowls. It's especially popular in gluten-free recipes and health foods across Europe and North America. Elsewhere in the plant, machines crush bananas into silky purees that will become creamy baby food or banana-flavored yogurts. Some are mixed into jams and sauces, while others are pressed into juice or blended into rich, frothy drinks. Even ice creams, candies, and cereals often hide a touch of banana, bringing a familiar tropical taste to millions of people. And that's not all. Some factories go a step further, slicing and freezing bananas to produce frozen fruit chunks for smoothie kits or fruit salads. Every part of this process is carefully automated and monitored for safety and hygiene, ensuring that the banana's natural sweetness is preserved at every stage. Thanks to this creativity and innovation, bananas leave their tropical origins to star in countless products. Every chip, every sip, every spoonful connects back to the lush green farms and the farmers who grew this incredible fruit. In Southeast Asia, bananas are much more than a simple fruit. They're a familiar and beloved part of everyday life. From Thailand to Indonesia, the banana appears in local traditions, recipes, and festivals. In Thailand, ripe bananas are often offered at Buddhist shrines as a symbol of respect and good fortune. While in Indonesia, banana leaves wrap fragrant rice and sweets, keeping food moist and fragrant with a subtle green aroma. In the Philippines, fried bananas known as turan or sweet saba bananas in syrup are popular treats served at street stalls and family gatherings. Across Vietnam and Cambodia, bananas take center stage in rustic dishes like grilled sticky rice bananas or rich coconut banana desserts, making them a taste of childhood for many. Bananas also play a role in important celebrations and rituals. Whether displayed on ancestral altars during holidays or eaten as part of daily meals, this tropical fruit connects people to their culture, their land, and each other. Throughout the region, bananas truly stand for abundance, tradition, and the simple joy of sharing food together. Every banana you taste has traveled a long and incredible road from lush tropical farms to careful hands that plant, tend, harvest, and pack them for shipment around the world. Along this journey, countless farmers, workers, and transporters pour their skill, strength, and patience into each bunch. Yet most of their hard work goes unseen. Next time you enjoy a banana, Pause for a moment to appreciate the immense effort that brings this simple fruit to your table. Think of the tropical heat that nurtures the crop and the long ocean crossings that carry these fruits to your local market.
Bananas may seem like a small everyday snack, but behind them lies a vast, intricate chain powered by nature and sustained by human hands. Every bite carries a story of rain and sun, of skill and tradition, of quiet dedication. So as you peel your next banana, remember to honor the invisible hands that made it possible. Without them, that sweet taste of the tropics would never reach you. If you enjoyed this journey, hit the like button, subscribe for more food origin stories, and share this video to celebrate the people behind the produce. Let's give credit where it's due to the hands that feed the world, one banana at a time.